brim. The brim. There was a spider on the brim. Here you go, Sabrina. And James, you are going to be Rudolph. Uh, it's wet. Yeah, Josh was going to be Rudolph, but he went home with a cold. Oh. oh, by the way, did you bring that doll for my friend? Uh, yeah, it's in my van. Here. I can't believe parents pay 200 bucks for a doll that sneezes. Yeah, you should see what they're charging for snot refill cartridges. Hi. Hi. So I went by the church and nobody signed up for baby Jesus yet. Hope can still be in the manger. I don't want to talk about it. I love those live nativity scenes. I always wanted to be in one. It'd be like camping with Jesus. So, she's a manger fan. Do you hear what I hear? Stop. Here's what I'm thinking, Sabrina. You should be in our manger with us. Mom. Seriously? Yeah. If Hope is baby Jesus, then as her guardians, we get to pick the rest of the cast. It's a great way to glorify God and also make people jealous when they see us featured on the Channel 3 News. That would be so much fun. <gasps> Wyatt would be mad. I'm supposed to hang out with his family on Christmas Eve. She would do it with us even if it makes her boyfriend mad. Do you hear what I hear a child? Sign her up. Thank you. Our annual tithing drive starts in three weeks. Um, this year's motto. I upped my pledge, up yours. Okay, lastly, I'm happy to announce that we have finally found our baby Jesus, and our 40-year tradition of a living nativity scene will be unbroken. We're heroes. This year, we will use all donations collected at the living nativity scene to repair the organ. And now, I'd like to introduce the baby that's become our little savior, <laughs> along with the family who will make up the rest of this year's living nativity scene. Please give a warm welcome to the Hwang family. Come on up, guys. That is a big baby Jesus. No way that kid came out of a virgin. The church. <laughs> Beautiful family. <laughs> so sweet. So they're the ones who'll be in the manger, huh? Yes. Yes. The Huangs are new to the congregation, and the committee just felt like we should ask them if they'd be interested. Uh, okay. So you guys didn't even sign up then, huh? No. Until we converted last week, we didn't even know what a manger was. <laughs> that is great. <laughs> Team players. Wow. Again, really. Beautiful family. Excuse us. What is going on? Look, the nativity scene needs to attract big donations if we are going to replace the organ. <laughs> now, I know that an Asian Jesus is unorthodox, but... Whoa, I am fine with an Asian Jesus, but let's be real here. That's a three-year-old fat kid. Where in the Bible does it say the wise men brought gifts to a three-year-old fat kid? Well, to be perfectly honest, Virginia, we were just a little bit afraid that Hope might scare people away with her reputation. Reputation? What, his word got out that she drools? No, no, we were willing to overlook that, but we just can't overlook the fact that she's a murderer's baby. A murderer's baby. That's what people call my daughter. Unbelievable, right? People in this town just love to give out labels. Mama, that's a TV fire. If you break the glass, you could electrocute yourself. It's like when I got pregnant with you. All of a sudden, people didn't see me as the captain of the drill team or the girl who could roller skate backwards down the big dirt hill behind the bank. No, I was the pregnant girl. People suck, Hope. It's time you knew that. Hell, that's why I love doing the manger so much. Because for one night a year, people didn't see me as trash that got knocked up by the guy who never wore a shirt to school. I was the Virgin Mary. I just don't want Hope to suffer like you did. There has to be some way to change your label. There is. She can be baby Jesus. 